Hello and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. Let's keep on going towards the goblin camp. I think I have no idea since oh wait. There's a way up here. So we may go further north from here. I know you cannot see my mouse pointer, but believe me. Going up here. Huh, some ruins. Okay, but let's look around here first. Oh, Wolfie. I want to have a word. Or doggy. It's hard to tell. No. Keep moving, stranger. Quietly. What happened here? I told you to go. I'm not an enemy, I promise. Mm. There's death in your scent, but not in your words. Still, you should go. My friend is injured. He needs rest. I don't think he's going to wake up. Of course he will. And then we'll return home. What happened to your friend exactly? We were attacked. We're cackling furry things on two legs. And their smell. It was strange, rotten, evil. You know the creatures he describes. Gnolls. Hmm. What's your name? He calls me Scratch. You can do the same. Come on, you can travel with me if you like. No, I won't leave him. If he doesn't wake up, follow my scent. I have a cup. If it comes to that, I may. Thank you. How come Shadowheart approves that? She does not know what I'm doing. She all they all they see is me either barking or just staring at the dog. How can they approve or disapprove of that? The fishing rod. Your sour face is tiring, Shadowheart. By all means, leave if I am so distasteful. No, I don't want to talk. What can I, do I don't want to talk. It's way too easy to talk to someone. Oh, bear bash. You know what I really miss about Baldur's Gate? Food. Freshest fish I've ever I don't care for fish. Red meat. Now, that's a different matter. Rare as can be. Dripping. Well, unless we find a cure, you won't yeah. have any teeth to chew it with soon enough. Mm hmm? Hmm. What's that? <laughs> Not a chance I'll fit in there. We need someone small. We definitely need someone small. Look, this. Oh, not damn it! Small creature. Small. Okay. Small is enough. Um, unless Scratch can do us a favor and go in there. Go on. If he doesn't wait, I'll find you. Okay. So that's a no. Okay, let's see those houses here then. Oh, we cannot go up here. Okay. So, you and Lay Zed. Please don't remind me. But keep your guard up with her. Back there? Okay, everyone, be quiet. I have to keep going. Weapon blueprints. A master blacksmith's work. Hmm. Not too refined here. Just quick ideas sketched out. 
something is walking behind the, these doors. What the hell are you doing? To carry on, there's bookshop in Dollar's Gate that would pay well for this kind of smut. Please don't kill me. Not enough. No, enough. Great. Tell of my rutting. My virility. Don't want this puny rutting written down. Puny? I am strong. I am virile. I am a... Enough! <laughs> Oh, a moment ruined, passion squished like slow goats underfoot. Oh, we leave. Don't, don't move away. Oh well. I don't want to take this pork. Hmm, I'll take that. Do you know where it is? I cannot see it. Okay, great. The book naturally falls to a dog eared page in which Pompo describes the more unusual races he has met in his travels. But they weren't half so strange as the bird folk. First, our cockroach Matt had the head of a parrot, the body of a human, and wings also of a parrot. I tried not to stare, but it was really hard. Turns out she was one of the motley party, cause around her table were a tabaxi, cat folk, a ganassi, element folk, and a turtle, turtle folk. Trying to act casual, I asked what they tell, what the hell they were, they were. They ignored me, but I can't blame them. To them, I must have looked awfully dull and average, for they were the first of their kind I'd seen, but I was just one of a billion born humans to them. As of the good of wizards all, who spend their whole lives learning, he grants their spells both big and small, for Mistra always yearning. May in the tyrant the black hand make sure the strong do rule. He spreads his darkness through the land, praised by the harsh and cruel. Besheba will bring forth your doom, unless you chant her prayer. Split from Tamara in the womb, she brings but light to spare. Okay. I the easy path. did not expect that at all. Oh, uh, give me a moment, bear back. I need to check something. Okay, I had to turn off the nudity. Fit for an ogre. Hmm. You notice a peculiar dagger protruding from the tough, leathery meat. Mm, examine the meat. Perhaps there's some trick to removing the dagger. You notice the blade is at an angle to the meat's grain. If you align the dagger with the grain... It should slip out easily. Hmm. Uh, align the dagger with the mist grain. Thanks to your keen eye, the dagger glides smoothly out of the mystery meat. Great, we have a dagger. And uh, dagger plus one, so I think a star could use it. Mm-hmm. Wait, it's three six, so... Oh, it doesn't matter. That was loud. Look what we got here! 
Another little birdie wanting to fly. Stop this thing! <laughs> Flap those wings some more, and I'll feed you a worm. And you. Hope you got a stomach for rights. Hmm. What the hell are you doing? What's it bloody look like? We're teaching this here pipsqueak to fly. Let me rephrase that. Why are you doing this? Cause it makes me laugh. <laughs> Time's over. Release the gnome. You want this little cave lurking what's it? Yes. Find your own. He's ours! The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is beyond reach until you rest. Hmm. All you lot against one deep gnome, you should go find a better target. Ew. That's enough. Yeah. I reckon we could do better than this run, eh? We're leaving. What about the gnome? Ain't we supposed to bring... I said we're leaving! There's plenty of sport and rich pickings out there for us. Alright then. Hmm. Okay, he's inspired. Oh, poor sheepy. Yeah, once I find a way to stop it. Wait, really? Is break lever? Oh. What the? Oh, birdie, you just flew away. Right. We'll get it sorted. Um, he flew. Oh. You sniffing where you ain't ought to be, friend. Might have to take that nose. Bloody booyah! Ah, someone's got there first. And you ain't learned your lesson! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Hmm. Perhaps I'll take something from you. Suggestions? All you best take is this warning, yeah? Step lightly around here. You're outnumbered. No one back home will ever believe this. Yeah. Locations of interest Elfson Tavern, Blushing Mermaid, Moonhaven Ruins, and the Dark. Wolburn, likely taken by force. Interview and several elements, known and unknown. I will find them. Dear Wolburn's mother, her name? A right to inquire, a right to inform, flames, of flames. Oh my goodness. What's this amulet? Oh well. From an overgrowth of moss, the well looks unremarkable. Hmm, peer into the well. Dry stones line the wall. At the bottom, something gleams in the dappled light. Hmm, okay, climb down the bucket rope. 
They'll alert their spinners with a mere touch. I hate spiders. I will save. One day I'll catch a break. Back up. Open up. Wait, oh my goodness. Okay, we definitely can go down here. Do you have Get on with it. I've got a long road ahead. Only I can. I, I mean I can you speaking with animals on myself, not on anyone else. with hastily sketched diagrams of spiders in various spell wounds. The captions are largely written in code. They for a few passages near the end that are pained in shaky common. They can sense my devotion. It draws them. I hear them in the shadows, whispers from the dark mother. I walk to a gift wrapped in spider silk, a pair of boots, taken from Keratic's corpse. Um, Love sends her daughters toward my faith, to let me know I am on the right path. Another gift. The corpse of a troll, Sidious scarred upon his face. An archomancer. Arachnomancer. One of the power to inhabit the spider's form. It is a message, a calling. My blood already dries upon the dagger. Her blessed image carved into my skin. And bloody Don't journal. If I do. And this web covered journal. This book leaves us. Leaves are stuck together with thick webbing that leaches ink when pulled from the page. Only the final entry remains remotely legible. It is time. I will forever transcend this blasphemous flesh and refreshen myself in the Queen's image. No longer will I be bound to this lowly form, this base shape of organ and bone. Even the Archnomancer's arm of Menzoberazan shall weep at my feet, the little spell so feeble and pleading. Today I found the house of love, and I shall be its martyrch. I recall my life upon the surface with more than regret. I weep for dec decades spent trading the murky waters of profanity while my true queen waited in the shadows. Even my name, Eliet, feels foreign and full upon my tongue. A half elf exalted by love for herself. My draw captors cannot fathom it. But I see their house is downfall in visions granted by the Spider Queen herself. When that day comes, when some unnamed whelp from an insignificant house cuts the matron mother's throat, I will escape. I will find solitude, and I will worship love with my very soul. I don't understand why some of the journals we mm, take with us and some we open on picking up. Okay, this way. Come on. Here's Astral Knowledge. Assume nothing. Oh, oh and come on. Hold up. I'm just looking. Initiative, great. Where's the rest? Give me a moment because the rest did not come. Um, where is he? I believe this is. Healing ward on self. Just to make sure we are. What the heck? Ether cup. I don't know you. I know face spiders. Okay. Keep 
Not enough movement to go. Wait, 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 wait. You can shoot it? Targets outside normal range. No? Okay. Oh, I don't like that. Of course, it's difficult terrain. Pressing shot on. Enough not enough movement? Okay. Damn it. Okay, shield of faith on you. This is your bonus action. And I want you to shoot. Wait, this is an action. Just shoot it. And a phase of footwork for you. Healing <laughs> words again. And just shoot it. This is bad. Section, not really. Okay, can you try hiding? Not really. Uh, oh, he tried anyway. Okay. Wait, no, this. This is your action. Those are bonus actions? No. Mm. Menacing attack on him. Menacing enough. It's dead. Okay. Um. Hmm. They're trying to poison all of us. Um. Okay, we don't have spells for that. I think we should heal him. And I'll... Yeah, we don't have, Very well. I don't have any option. I want to go over here and... Kill you! Also to move back a little bit. Talk to me. 
you have firebolt. Is he also in range? Yes. God damn it. Can again do your menacing attack? Simple toxin. Dip your weapon into that. And turn. Can you get nearer to him? Not enough movement. And if he jumped? Can you get to him now? Mm. God damn it. I don't want to risk. Okay. I'll jump over there next time. Oh, we can go up there. Okay. That's one way to do this. Get out of the toxin. Heading there. I'm fury. I am death. Yeah, this is used our superiority. Dice, I don't want to waste it so much. running away. With haste. I forgot to use... Hmm? Uh, I forgot to use uh, mana, mana potion, health potion. Movement to get up there. Oh god damn it! We can. I cannot even shoot it from here. Oh my goodness. Okay, shoot this one. And go over there. You drink potion. And hit him. Something else you can do. Can you shoot him? Great. This one of you can do this. Do <laughs> we need to get up there? Drink the potion. Shoot him. Oh. Look at this. Thank you. Now, if you don't mind, get up there. was great. Now get up there. Stay focused. Um, okay, 
use cure wounds on yourself. Can't. Hey, never mind. Keep shooting it. Cut them! No, 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 no way! I hate it when the map just moves randomly around. <laughs> Might as well. There's a buddy here. A skeleton. Can... Another step forward. Okay, pick her up. Uh, How did you manage to do that? There's a soft bedroll in my near future. in here. Oh, I think we only gold. This doesn't look promising. Defense, she's level five. We are level three. Mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. We are not doing that. There's nothing for us to do over here. I just came here because I was curious if there was something beneath the well. guys come on I hope we can get out of yeah we can get out of here we'll get back here once we are cured I think by that time we will level up twice okay what else what else what else I think there's something wrong with this fireplace. Come on, guys. Really? Tastes like chicken. No chicken. Tastes like fish. 
gentlemen, contain yourselves. This quarrel sells our feast. Besides, tastes like pork. And what surprise is this? Brothers, look here. I have eyed yet another tiefling prize. Fortune favors our bellies. Stranger, be you friend or food. The mark is her measure. Show us the brand of the absolute. Hmm. You're quite eloquent for an ogre. Am I not astonishing? A robust diet makes for a shrewd mind, you see. I am a gourmand. And you, a delicacy. Unless you bear the mark, of course. I'll do you one better. I guess I don't have the subject. I'll do you one better. No, are you dainty, Tiffling? She scampered in from the east, calling for you. A pet, no doubt. The green earth bless us. She bore no mark. Those horns. Such cartilaginous crunch. Let's see the mark, lest I give in to my cravings. How do you want that? I'm one of the absolute chosen disciples. Uh. Oh. I told you, we cannot lie. And we don't have... In we have inspiration. Okay. Great. Indeed. How regrettable that your meat must go unsavoured. Food? Food. Not food. Friend. I notice you don't bear a brand of your own. I've no use for the absolute. Or any god. I follow two masters only. Gluttony and greed. The goblins understand my appetites. They sate my hunger for gold. And the rest sate my hunger for meat. Boss goblin give gold. We check brand. Good deal. No talk. Hmm. I've seen a few other ogres in this part. Oh, the wrong one. I am, by all accounts, a student of higher commerce and extortion. Make me an offer. Tempt me. I'll pay you in the flesh of the fallen. You'll have your feel. Oof. Nope. Slip of the tongue. You meant to make a better offer, surely. I have tried my mind offers off the table. It's dinner time, no! Boys. God damn it. I did not mean to fight with them. <sighs> Give me a moment. So I went back. And unfortunately, this time, we succeeded. A brilliant notion, and oh. a boon to my aching belly. We have a deal, my tasty kibble. Take my bone horn. One blow, and the ground will quake with my family name. Use it when the need arises, and never a moment before. Ogre kill everyone around, then Ogre eats them! Well spoken, indeed. Ogre kill everyone around. Okay, thank you. We will keep close. When you are ready, sound the horn. 
Yes, and one more thing. Oh. Oh, they went away. Um. Open up. I want to mark the well. Anything of use? Something over there. Tips, tools, gold. I don't want the hand axe. Mm hmm. Cracked. Oh, so we. I, I I guess we could have killed them. I'm not quite sure since I cannot really see up here. Uh, though clearly all oh, this handbill has managed to maintain its ball print over time. For one reason on for one season only, see the play that sent a little of a light theater into chaos. The sharp tongue traveling troop presents the folly and the folk, a tragedy in four parts. Part one. Lost of, of Lost Nefroil, the Great Wizarding Empire in Humans Age of Wonder. Part 2 of the Great Mage Carsus, his brief and terrible godhood and the ruin he wrought. Of Nefroil's fall, a thousand years of shade and sharp subversion. Part 4 of Nefroil's return and his shadow falling upon the land. Penned by the great bard Bragon Fag, the folly and the fall tells the true story of the flying netherized netter city. Tul Tantar, and it's a dramatic return after a thousand years in exile on Shar's Plane of Shadow. See the climat climactic battle above Myth Draenor, rendered in stunning detail thanks to the finest tomaturges on the coast. Direct on your village green as the sharp tongued traveling troop makes it its transit to Baldur's Gate, sit now or face a thousand years of sorrow. More for me. There's really lots. Of books. Okay, come on, pick it up. The well is somewhere here. It's right there. Well. Okay. Took it, you took it. Great. Now, which way we should go? Here we have the Coven Saza. We have the Crash. Goblin Priestess. Wait, the Goblin needs help again? There's a fire going. Oh. Okay. What do we have here? There's so much to be checked on around here. Come on. It's really a shame that we can only take one path at a time. I mean, we could send each one of them separate places. Come on, I'll tell the guards what's what. Okay, lead the way then. Here. Yeah? What's that? I've been in some druid's grove. This one spring me. Now move over so I can tell Regslin myself. Hold on. Where are the raiders? Dead. Every last one. Regslin's drow friend won't be happy to hear that. She'll be happy enough when I tell her where them lubies is holding up. Let me through. Hold on now. Is it true what Saz says? You helped her escape that grove. It was a daring escape. So thirteen druids barehanded, Saja and I. Uh, yeah, that's that's right. Ha! 
Oranga and Sazza killing druids. Pull the other one. That's enough out of you. Come on. Gotta let the drown know where them looters is. We'll be heroes. I don't want to tell them where the druids are, though. This way. So we could have snacked in? Yeah. We don't need Sa- We don't- didn't need Saja to get inside. authority that you've used on others only infinitely stronger and turned against you your vision clouds leaving you in a dark featureless shadowscape nothingness in every direction then there are three figures before you an armored male elf exuding power and command a handsome younger man with a quick easy smile and a pale young woman with even paler eyes. These are my chosen. They speak for me. Aid their search for the prison, and you will be worthy to stand beside them. Give me that look. I don't know what just happened any more than you do. We should keep going. The voice is gone. Muted by this... this gith relic. Why does a half-elf carry it? The vision. That voice. What was it? I think that was the Absolute speaking to us. But we managed to shield ourselves. We should keep moving. Hold on, that artifact seemed to stop the voice. What is it? I don't know. Not exactly. All I know is it's important I get it back to Baldur's Gate. At any cost. Hmm. Why Baldur... Baldur's Gate? Why... What aren't you telling me? I suppose, if we're to continue together, I may as well tell you. I serve Shah. My home is a secret cloister in Baldur's Gate. A group of us were sent to retrieve the artifact. Now I'm the only one left. I can't afford to fail. I can't tell you anymore. This mission required utmost secrecy. We all submitted to having our memories suppressed so that we couldn't betray Shah's confidence. If I reach my contact in the city, I'll have my memories restored. Until then, I have to guard the artifact with my life. There. You have the truth, for all it's worth. Let's continue. Heavens forbid. We're all entitled to our secrets. Hmm? Your faith is your own concern, not mine. True. I didn't think you'd react so pragmatically. Perhaps I should have told you sooner. In future, I expect you to be honest. Let's leave it at that for now. Gladly. Hmm. 
Okay, do we really want to go in here? And, oh, the, wait, the druid? The druid disappeared. Wait. Oops. The truth is no longer here. Okay. No, I mean not okay. Like they've captured themselves a bard. Or be you beheaded. Goblin. Oh, hi Holo. What are you doing here? Fragulous crown and with scepter a braid. Draw Ragslin. Short work of the innkeeper made. <laughs> the inn burnt to ash. The captives were many. Goblet kind had reduced them to cowering filfenny. So raise it, your goblets, and drain them with pride. Draw Ragslin, the true soul, had led you gallant. <laughs> Continue rhyming. For our souls have been truer than the racks in the door. Huh? That was good. Carry it on, Pitting. Mm. And if you saw him kill Merlins, you'd have to yell. Hum! I heard tracks and cast shadows that are 20 leagues wide. I really don't try to get him killed, but that might be the outcome. Mm. Why? Uh, he's a meatier creature than any I've spied! Oh, Boulder Dash! Oi, stranger! You make him with my pitching! He's talking stupid now. Come, let's continue our ballad. Draw Ragslin, draw Ragslin. I am a draw Ragslin. Tumptuous, draw Ragslin. You broke him! Wait, wait. Draw Raxlin, we pray, we... Come on, Pigeon, back to your cage. Now, oh, look what you've done. Sorry. Of course. I need that Idiot. chicken. I need that chicken. Some food. Right, yes. You More food. Right. I think I clicked it. We have to find escape. Escape! Okay. What's happening here? Statue of Saluna. This room must have been dedicated to her. And now it's a nest for some filthy goblins. A fitting end. Hey, only it's because this is not your goddess, you shouldn't be acting like this. Okay. Just having a bit of fun. Oi, so much fun that those thieves almost got past. We got them now, eh? Oi! Ain't no party in here. Shut it, Graw. Olak cleared us. Got a visitor for the drow, I do. My ass. What's a true soul want with any mate of yours? Private business, that is. Raiding business. But if anyone wants a piss pot guarded, we'll call. Just get your friend Brandon proper. Right, Sazza? Got better things to do than... No, you don't. Come on, then. Bloody rat. Saluna. 
as if mingling with a horde of goblins wasn't bad enough. Let's do what we have to do, then get out of here. Not usual, and I take it. Quite the understatement, but yes. Let's not linger in this place any more than necessary. Okay, I'm gonna say it's right here. Hear the voice? Oh, vile idolatry. Makes my stomach you. turn. Smells of one. The goblins' decorations are uncrustaceous. Now, here's somebody special. The Absolute has touched you, hasn't she? Priestess Gut needs to touch you too. Hold out your arm so I can mark your flesh. Hmm. I assume this mark has a purpose. Shows our devotion to the Absolute. These maggots see how strong we are with her guidance. Whole camp will be branded soon. And you should be too. You ready? Brace yourself. This'll sting. No. Actually, I'd rather not go through it with Maybe this. you don't need it. After all, you're special, ain't ya? Like me. She probes your mind, tangling your thoughts with hers. A familiar sensation. She too carries a power. Darkness seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man, one of the chosen. The vision dissolves away. You stand before the goblin priestess in the temple once again. Hmm. Severed connection. Your minds brush against one another, but are swiftly parted. Don't want to get intimate in front of the novices. Fair enough. Got some weird shadows in your head. Maybe I can help with that. Us true souls gotta look out for one another. Do you think you can fix whatever's causing those shadows? With the absolute's will? I can fix anything. Let's deal with this in my chapel. It's private. Don't want this lot interfering with true soul business. Oi, priestess, we want the mark. Why do they yeah. think they're talking to a god? Ain't we good enough for the absolute? Moment, priestess. Don't go bothering my pigeon, he's mine. So I see, do you have pass for this pigeon? Keep him safe. Listen to him coo. Till I get hungry or some such. What's it to ya? Hmm. I will, I will, I had to see such a lovely creature in a cage. Hey, he don't mind. Keeps him safe from me mates. <laughs> Raids make him rabbit. Then catch one on your own. The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is beyond reach until you rest. Hmm. I've taken a shine to this one. How much do you want for him? More than you got, mate. I likes him. But, um, how much do you got? Offer him all the sun. Pigeons worth more than that. Times a Bagolian. Okay, about the how much? Ugh, I could buy twelve pigeons with that much. Here's the key. Pigeons all yours. There you go. <laughs> Look at this. I'm quite saved. A joy to see a familiar face in such a precarious setting. 
I guarantee the story of your daring rescue of my person will live on for eons. Remember my name when you're crediting the stories, Arthur. It's Evna. That will sound ridiculous. But fine, if you insist, as much as it pains me to cede creative control. Once I've written you into one of my books, there won't be a tavern in Feru. You can enter without receiving a hero's welcome. We mustn't tarry, but I'd hate for our friendship to end here. Please, won't you meet me once we've both slipped the goblin yoke? Mm. Go to my camp, we'll talk there, once we're both safe. Smashing! Soon, my friend. Soon we can share the flagon of something liquid and a tale of daring do. I'll slip away when the coast is clear. See you soon, my friend. I simply can't wait to pick your brain! Another one. I keep forgetting that... <laughs> yeah, we couldn't... We could have taken Saja out of the prison easier. Oh, well. Now maybe I'll remember to use the portions I have. But I think that's gonna be it for today, so for now. Foul stench of slaughter turns suddenly sweet through the rat's nose. Blood smell. Life smell. Not like the great hollow below, which smells only of death. Hmm. So, for now, I'm gonna end this part here. Thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!